Okay, we're back and we got some uh, projects to Zomboid. Um, oh, hello. That's new. What do I do to attract this guy's attention? I don't know, but there seems to be a lot of zombies coming this way, actually. Dead. What are you doing? These guys might have actually been following me this entire time, which is from a distance. You know, like the, uh, like the helicopter from Season 2 of Walking Dead. I feel like I just saw something down there. Oh well. Okay. We're gonna have to clear out the farmhouse and uh, make sure it's safe in there. Um, I've pretty much decided I'm gonna keep moving on. And I also took a quick look at the map when I made the uh, thumbnail, since I've been using the uh, map as the thumbnails. And yeah, I'm nowhere near getting to uh, like the rivers in between West Point and. Uh, that noise? Is that music? Okay, I think it was just music. Uh, but yeah, the river is in between West Point and the mall. It's not in between Muldraw and West Point, as I thought it was. So, I mean, that was kind of stupid. I kept looking for this river. It's not. I'm not going to see it for, like, probably a couple episodes. Because it's going to take a little... It's going to take a while, you know, to get all the way to West Point. It's a bit of a walk. And this place is pretty much the last stop. And, well, I don't know, there's like a... I think there's like a gas station between here and there. So I need to make sure I have plenty of food and water before I leave here. And plenty of not zombies in all these rooms. There are not any zombies in this house. That's pretty nice, actually. It's refreshing. I'm tired of opening up doors and then there's like a zombie like right there. But thankfully I have not been uh, bitten yet or even like scratched like so far the zombies have been pretty uh, they've been pretty lucky with them let's grab the chips dog food no thank you grab some more chips you can just live off of uh, potato chips and I kind of love it okay bread I think can carry I think I'll uh, eat an orange here Onion doesn't give you a negative effect, so let's eat an onion. I'll make sure I'm plenty, plenty full here. Eat an entire ham. <laughs> That's probably a bad idea. Very well fed. Wonder if you can overeat. I don't know. I really don't want to grab too much out of here, since uh, you know, this stuff will go bad eventually. Okay. Okay, so I think if we go this way we can get out. Maybe. It's uh oh god, how tired am I? I'm very getting to be very tired. But if I sleep now, then I'll wake up at like three in the morning. It's only three o'clock now. So at most I'll sleep twelve hours, I think. Which oh for Christ's sake, why did I leave through the window oh I didn't leave through the window, but there we go. Door unlocked. Um, hmm. It's a bit of a quandary. Because I really don't want to be caught out in the middle of the woods, like, so tired I just pass out, you know? I guess I could, like, read till then. The problem is, like, yeah, I can assuade my, uh, I don't think that's the right word, but I can, like, you know, make my character not bored, but that still doesn't make for an interesting video. So I think I'll cut it here, and we'll get started uh, tomorrow morning when I wake up. Okay, we're back. Uh, we managed to sleep in until almost 5 a.m., which that's nice. I, you know, I just really hate waking up at 4 or 3 in the morning and uh, not being able to see when I go outside. So uh, I'm going to go ahead and get started here. Well, let's see if there's anything to the south of here. Like around this way. Is there zombies coming from this way? I don't know if that means anything. Um, there's another clearing. There might be more farm down here or something. That'd be cool. There's the field over there. Uh, let's follow this clearing, because we're going to keep going this way, mostly. And I feel like if we just follow clearings, we'll get to the road eventually. Hopefully. Oh crap, there's zombies around. 
that's a good sign, because that means we're close to civilization, I'd assume. Let's go ahead and kill this one. Just so we don't have to hassle with uh, having to follow us around and stuff. I guess her. It's not... Let's not demonize these. Let's not dehumanize these zombies. They were people once. She was people once. Let's go all Rick, Rick Grimes here. And she was married. Like she had a husband. Okay, whatever. Um, yeah, what's up with this dirt here? It's interesting. Yes, yes, I knew it. I knew I'd be able to find a road by following clearings. All right. Oh, shit. I probably shouldn't be running everywhere. I probably also should have eaten something before I left. This guy is really gray. I don't know if it's the time of day or what, but... Looks like sips. Come on. Kill the freaking zombie. There we go. Yeah, I'm winded because I was, uh... Running before that. Let's make sure there's nothing around. Okay. Alright. So, we're going to head up the road here. Um, eventually... If I get onto the main road again, there should be like a gas station and like a few fast food restaurants, like halfway in between the two towns, because you know, just for people that are walking. I'm, I just really assume that they're gonna put vehicles in this at some point because uh, it'd be kind of ridiculous not to, with how big the map is. But it should definitely be work to try to get one working, you know, like because if someone was able to get a car running, they would have taken it and left, you know. So anything left would be uh, kind of crap and not running. There we go. I'm getting pretty good at that, actually. Let's, uh, let's see here. No, don't drop it. Eat all of one of those. Okay. There we go. It's kind of hard to... Uh, negotiate the menu when you're uh, expecting a zombie to be right behind you at any moment. Let's not go up that way. Let's just follow the paved road here. I went off road once and I got horribly lost, so it's not, let's not repeat that problem again. Although, there are zombies everywhere on this road. Jesus. I might have to stop killing them and start just running by. Yeah, especially if I can't hit them first try. There we go. Kill him. Get him. Kill him. Murder. Okay. Just gotta check your six every once in a while, too. Hey, pink shirt. Wait, that's not pink shirt. It's kind of a... I don't know. Light red? <laughs> okay. Ah, I love this track. This game does have some really fantastic mu music, by the way. Alright, so there was a zombie off in the woods over this direction, so I'll just walk by and hope he doesn't see me. I don't think he saw me. Let's, let's hurry up here. We got places to be. We gotta go to the mall, get some get some shoes. Gotta get some shoes and some shirts. Some, uh, those helicopters where you pull a thing and it makes it go up in the air. But it's not really an RC helicopter, it's just like a... It's like one of those Barbie spinny things, but like, for boys. Uh, I don't know what I'm talking about. Like, you're, I all know if you've seen those, like, you the viewer, like, at the local mall I'm talking about, uh, around where I am, there's, like, this, uh, stand, like, you know how they have the kiosks and, like, the throwaway or whatever, and there's, like, this dude that had, like, these helicopters, and, like, they're basically, you know, you just, like, press a button and the helicopter takes off. And it's not like, uh, you can't really control it, but he was, like, making it, like, it'd go up and then land, like, he'd be able to catch it again. I'm like, I don't think, like, I can't imagine being able to do that. He's just making it look easy. Alright, here's the main road. Awesome. So we're almost there. And by almost, I mean, uh, we can just find our way a little bit easier. Come on. Die. Alright. I meant to hit the control button to check around here. I guess it's pretty empty, so that's nice. And since it's the uh, apocalypse, I can just walk in the middle of the road, no problem. I'd feel kind of weird, like, if I was walking over on this side. Well, no, this is, like, the side you're supposed to walk on if you're, uh, you know, pedestrian. If you're walking in a road, you walk against the traffic so you can see them coming. 
because if you have like the wind at your back or something, like you won't be able to hear a car coming. And I think it should be the same for bicycles, but they tend to uh, like make people on bikes on the same side of the road as traffic or whatever, and that's that just doesn't seem quite right to me. Oh crap! That guy didn't die. He chunks fell off. Hey, s screw off. Get away from me. There we go. Uh oh. Oh, get off of me. Oh, that was close. That was close. Come on. Come here. Don't push her. Fucking hit her with the thing. Come on. It's not that freaking hard. Kill. Destroy. There we go. I'm panicked. I was definitely panicked during that whole thing. Like, I almost died. She, like, got so close to biting me. Oh, my God. Just thankfully her animation didn't finish, and I think that's how it registers if it's successful or not. Ugh, another zombie up there. Oh man, it's starting to get a little crowded around here. Let's kill the one that's already detected me. Just so... Come on. Does she have, like, blood dripping onto her, like, chest there? Like, from where she ate somebody? That's some detail, man. Alright. Exerted again. Let's try to get around... No, this guy. I mean, this lady. Saw me. Stop it. There we go. We're slowly making our way downtown, walking fast. Zombies around us. Um. Yeah, screw you. I'm, sw I'm walking away. I'm taking Lord Humongous's advice and walking away. Alright. I assume this is still the way to go. Hold on, this is... Let's get there faster, hey? Hey? It's probably a bad idea because I'm going to start running into even more and more zombies and I'll be exerted. Yeah, let's take a little breather here. Um, frame rate issues. That's not a good sign. I feel like that means there's going to be so many zombies my computer can't handle it up here. Because I should be approaching the fast food area. But I can't get off the road or anything. What? Yeah, I saw him, like, coming a mile away. It's not really a shock. Yeah, if I had the zombies on default, some of them would be able to kind of, like, stumble towards me. And, uh, it's no fun. Like, number one, I don't believe that's zombies. I like these Romero-style zombies better. But it also, like, they can, like, stumble about the same speed you can walk. Which I've always been like, uh, you should be able to outpace zombies really easily. But it's the sheer numbers is what gets you. Like, they're constantly, like, like, zombies represent death. And, like, you know, you can prevent it, but eventually it's going to happen to you. No matter how much, like, you're going to screw up, eventually. And that's kind of the beauty of this game. Is there, like, a slight heartbeat every time I get, like, panic and stuff? Because I am, like, strong panic. Which is bad. Extreme panic. So yeah, I'm not really worried about it. Just walking away. Maybe I need to kill one to assuage my panic here. I'll keep using that word. I don't think it's the word I mean to use. Okay. There. Do I feel better? No. Because I let those other ones catch up with me a little bit. And now I'm winded. Okay. Let's just take a little jog here. Because I want to get down to those uh, fast food places. Because I should be able to sleep there if I need to. It's only 10 a.m. It's not a good sign. Like, I just, like, I've been running for a long time. It's a highway sign. That's a good sign. Like, <laughs> might mean I'm entering a little uh, fast food area down here. Yeah, there's totally a heartbeat noise. That's awesome. I can only hear it every once in a while because my mic, uh, well, I mean, my headset, like the earphones, cut out every once in a while. <laughs> Spiffos. It's raining meat. Oh, God. Gunshots. It's not a good sign. Well, they're all headed the same way I am, so I shouldn't end up coming up behind them, I don't think. But that also means they're all going to be around where I'm headed, which that's not good. <laughs> I wonder if I can just blend in, because I'm walking the same way they're all walking. 
Also, like, they have a larger range of directions they can move, as it turns out. Like, I can I only have, like, eight directions or so. And they can, like, just kind of meander around and go in, like, diagonals and stuff. I can't do that. Alright, so this should be the fast food stuff down here. Let's see what this first one is. If I can find it, I'll know which direction it is. Is it up here? Yeah, there's one. I might have to kill a whole bunch of zombies that are around me. Oh god. There's so many zombies. Die. Okay. Um. Okay. Cool. Uh, one more. One more. One more. There we go. This is not going well. Alright. We can do it, though. I believe in the me that believes in us. Just knock them down so I don't have to worry about them. Uh-oh. When that lady starts singing, it's a bad sign. There. Oh, yes. Okay. Alright. Good, 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 good. Good, 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 good. Everything's good. Nothing's bad. Die. Oh. Come on. Hey, I'm taking on all of you motherfuckers. Yes. Okay. I could, I'm a bit peckish, so let's uh, hop into the... <laughs> Let's go to the diner here. Oh, they're closed. What? What a ripoff. Hey, this guy's breaking that window over there. Vandal. Let's kill this lady. No, I like her style. The black hair with like the monochrome clothes and like the gray skin. Very, uh, very in right now. Oh shit. Jesus. That was close. <laughs> okay. So, I'm really not doing very good at this point. Um, there's like a fenced-in area back there. I don't think, I don't think that'll help me any. All right, cool. There's probably gonna be zombies in here, and there's probably gonna be zombies pouring in through the windows. Now that I made a bunch of noise to attract them. Outdoors, the great outdoors. Let's head over across the way here. See what else there is to see. There's a place down here, so let's kill a zombie. Oh, this is the gas station. Okay. Die. Die. Oh, for Christ's sake. There we go. Can I use the gas pumps? Probably not, because. No, no, there's still electricity. Uh, I just wonder if I could interact with them and uh, get gas into a gas container or something if I have to do that. Let's check out this convenience store down here. It's a pretty uh, backwoods convenience store, actually. A little sketchy. Oop. There we go. Oh, also, uh, I realized in the last video, I was not in my main inventory when I was trying to check my uh, axe which is right here. So damage, it's uh, still doing pretty good, so that's not a problem. Let's uh, break the window here. Whoa, what was that? Oh, shit. Shit. Get out of there. Get the hell out of there. Okay, we gotta, we gotta take shelter a little bit. Alright, close the door so they can't follow me in here. Uh, close this door so they can't follow me out there. Just in case. Ah, ah. Alright. <laughs> so, uh, that's about enough for uh, today's episode of MVK. We might have just made a tomb for ourselves, I don't know. We're gonna check once the alarm stops going off, and we're gonna go out there uh, in the next episode here see what the damage is. So, uh, see you later.